It's now time to let your left hand catch up with what your right hand has been doing. If you've been practising all your right hand scales, you'll know how they should sound. And if you've been practising your C major in the left hand, as we did for lesson two, you are ready to tackle all the remaining grade one scales for one hand only. And even better, you've already learnt the fingering pattern three for one octave scales and three for three for the two octave scales. We have to sharpen F to F sharp when we play G major. The left hand scale over one octave sounds like this. And over two octaves, like this. And this is what it looks like in scales books. To play G major, start with the little finger on G. Remember that all we need for one octave is three, and we must sharpen F to F sharp. Start with five, go up to one, three over, F sharp, down to three, thumb under. And for the two octave version, three, four, three, starting with five, traveling up to thumb, three over, four over, three over, remembering the F sharp, down to three, thumb under, four, thumb under, three, thumb under, We had to use our second finger on a black key for G major, and it's the same with F major. This time we'll be playing B flat instead of B with our second finger. This is what F major sounds like over one octave. And over two octaves. And this is what it looks like in the scales books. For F major, start with the fifth finger on F. Remember that we will have to blacken our second finger on B flat, so put that there ready. And all we need to remember is three. Five, up to the thumb. Three over, down to three, thumb under, and blacken the two. Three over, down to three, And for the two octave scale, three, four, three. 
5 up to 1, 3 over, 4 over, remembering to blacken the tool, 3 over, down to 3, down to 4, 3, For D major, we are again going to play a black key with our second finger on C sharp, but also with our third finger on F sharp. This is what D major looks like when played by the left hand over one octave. And over two octaves. And this is what it looks like in scales books. For D major, start with your five on D and remember that we're going to need F sharp. So prepare your third finger ready. You'll also need C sharp with your second finger. Start with five, travel up to one. Three over, there's the black two, down to three, thumb under. Three over, down to three, under. Three, three. And for two octaves, three, four, three, three, four, three. Well done. Don't forget to practice all your scales, not just the three we've done in this lesson. And remember that if you need to, you can always revisit previous lessons online. In the next lesson, we'll learn the remaining three left-hand scales. See you soon.